Welcome to the channel, I trust that you're doing well. In this video, I'm going to show you how to transfer your assets between the Spot account and the Futures account. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and hit subscribe. I also have a step-by-step -step beginner tutorial on how to trade the Futures market as well as how to trade on BitGet's Spot market. So for anybody that might be interested, I'll leave a link for those videos in the description down below. Let's get into it. To transfer your assets internally between Spot and Futures account, just simply come up here to Assets and then from this drop down menu, click on Transfer. This will bring you over to the transfer form and you can see that we're currently set to Bitcoin, but if it's a different coin you want to transfer, just give that a click. In my case, I have some Tether, so I'll just go ahead and select Tether here. Now we're set up to transfer Tether from Spot into USDT Futures account here. You can flip these around by using these arrows, so if I give that a click. Now it's set to transfer from the USDT Futures account back into Spot, but I'll go ahead and just switch this back as I'm transferring from Spot to Futures. Down below, you'll be able to see your available balance, so you can type in a custom amount that you wish to transfer, or you can click on All, Confirm, and now I've transferred those coins from Spot into Futures. Now we can come over here to Assets, and if I toggle over here to Futures, you can see that the Tether is now in my Futures account. If I want to transfer that back into Spot, I can come over here on the right hand side under Operation and I can click on Transfer. Or alternatively, you can use the Transfer button up here beside Withdraw. I'll just go ahead and use the one down here under Operation. Down here you can see that we're set to transfer USDT from Futures into Spot. Looks good, so I'm just going to click on All, Confirm, and now I've sent those assets back into Spot. So let's come over here to the Spot account, give that a click. If you don't see your tether right away, just simply refresh the page. So I'm going to come up here, refresh the page. And there's the tether in the spot account. And there you have it. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to leave a like and hit subscribe. Feel free to check out some of my other BitGit tutorials, which will be on my YouTube channel in the playlist. And I'll link a couple of them down below for you as well. Thanks so much for popping by to check out this video. Looking forward to seeing you in the next one. And until I do, have yourself a powerful day.